Hi there and welcome. Today I'm going to show you how you can add Notebook LM Podcast to a message area. And I'm on Moodle here and I've added it. This is what it will sound like when I play. Hey everyone and welcome to another deep dive. Today we're taking a look at how AI can be used in English language teaching or ELT. We've got the slides right here from a course called AI for ELT. Right, so I stopped that. Let me go into Notebook LM. This is uh, the deep dive, the podcast. What I did was the following. First thing I did was go into this and download. I downloaded the file. After I downloaded the file, I went into Google Drive and into new and then file upload. Okay, went into the file. It exists, so I'm not gonna uh, replace it. I'm gonna keep both, all right, because it's already here. So once it's here, and notice it's coming up and there's the second one, but let's go to the first one. It's exactly the same. Once it's here, you go into share and then share again. And notice anyone with the link as a view, and then you copy the link, all right? Next, you go into your browser window. Let me do that now. Now it's in my browser window. You're going to go into the three dots, three dots, and then embed item. You're going to copy only the link, notice here, with a size that you can actually change. Okay, but you don't need the size. You're going to go up to here, or if you want to add the whole thing, you can add the whole thing, but I'm going to go up to here where I can change the size, which is what happened. Next, I'm going to copy it, go back into my course, which is here and uh, go into, let me just reply to myself here, go into advanced, of course, so I have all the editing tools. Now I've got the editing tools, going to go into insert, Scroll down until I get to Generica Widgets. Click on that, choose Website, add the link, insert. Okay, and there it is. Now you can play it. And they also explain how to manage links, which is super helpful for sharing. All right, so that's it. That's how you embed so that um, participants don't have to go into the site. Another thing that you might want to uh, no, is the fact that these things are not saved. Okay, this is something that I don't know if they tell you about this. But if I go into, right now I'm here. Okay, I'm going to stop that. Okay, and go into my site. You need to click on the word notebook and then you get this. There is AI for ELT. So what happens is if you go to the old ones, okay, from October, okay, 16, notice what happens. Okay, I go into notebook guide. The conversation is gone. You'll need to reload it. And that's why sharing the link will not work. What I mean is the link, let me go back here to this one. It might still, no, this one won't be fresh either. I'm trying to find the one that I just created now. Let me go back to well, notebook. If I go into this one, notice, and notebook guide, because that's where I will find it, it's gone. So you can't share it really, even if you go into share and, um, and you copy the link. All right, let's copy the link and go into a browser window. I copy the link, let's go into the note guide and notice the same thing. So it doesn't last. The only way to share is through Google Drive and make sure you make it available for anyone who has the link when you share. That's really, really important. Let me know if you have any questions. Thank you for watching. Have a great day.